Hi guys, this is Joe Kelly. Today we're going to be talking about your self-tapes because self-tapes are everything there is right now and probably more so in the future too. So there's a lot of advice out there and you might be hearing a lot of things and you might not know which way to go, which means that at the end of the day when you have a self-tape, you're taking way too long to do it, right? You don't know what to choose, what to take, so you film the whole day. And then before sending the things to your agent, you have no idea which take to choose. But when you look at it, you're thinking, okay, it's good, but like you're not self-impressed, right? They're not special enough. They're what we could call a little bit generic because you're trying to do it well. And the thing is, the bigger the opportunity with your self-tapes, the bigger the role the more struggle you're going to have with those self-tapes. So the more time it will take you, the more doubt you will have about which self-tape to choose, not to mention which backdrop, which prop, which, you know, everything that comes with the self-tape world. So what I want to say and the, the, what, what I want to look at with you today is, well, what can you do in these circumstances? There's so much struggle inside of your self-tapes that oftentimes I hear casting directors say, well, I can put check marks on everything. The tape, self-tape is not bad, but it's not incredible, right? So what's, what's actually happening here is that all of this struggle that you might think is the problem you have with self-tapes is actually only a consequence of the real problem. The root cause of you struggling with your self-tapes is that you are not actually present. You're disconnected from your instinct, you're disconnected from the moment, and because of that, you're relying on everything outside of yourself to do your self-tape. Once you have your instinct down, you can be here in front of the camera and your presence does the whole job. So no matter how good your self-tape looks, you being there, you're alive, fully present, and fully instinctive is what casting directors are looking for. They are crazy about that because it's so rare for anyone to be that present. So what's happening? Where is your instinct hiding? Well, the thing is that you've been programmed to not be instinctive. You've been educated and wired and conditioned to not be instinctive, to not follow your impulses. You've been taught and told with authority to behave a certain way, to feel a certain way, to think a certain way, and not to trust yourself, right? So until you do the work of working through the resistance in order to reconnect with your instinct, well, there's no way that you can have access to that instinct, right? Does that make sense? So, um, what I usually hear actors say when they do this training, which is actually a month, it takes a month to reset yourself, work through the resistance, reboost your instinct, and be present all the time, even under pressure. When I hear um, actors um, do their self-tapes and use this work, they'll say after only a couple days, after like three days, they'll write to me and say, Joe, this is incredible. I was just cold reading for a self-tape that I just got. Usually I would get in my head. I'd be nervous about this and none of it happened. I've never felt so free. Everything was flowing. Everything was making sense. The art took care of itself. I was just present and it was so much fun. And that's what I want for you guys because that's what's possible and that's probably why you became an actor in the first place is to feel all of this exhilarating life going through your veins. And that's what the casting directors want to see too. So if this makes any sense, like the video. If you have any questions or comments about this, please put them in there. My, myself or my team will get to them and we'll answer you. And then subscribe to the channel because we have a lot of videos coming all about your career and all about how you can make things happen for yourself. Um, you can share it. You can also, uh, no, I think that's it. I said everything. I forgot one thing. I have a free training for you. Um, so if you click on the link below, I'll give you free access to this training, which will help you already um, to, it'll help you start making steps in that direction into working through your resistance and into your instincts so you can always be present and fully alive when you do your self-tapes. 
Okay, so the training is called Stop Trying to Be a Good Actor so you actually have a chance of being great. All right, well, thank you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.